Welcome to the next episode of the Understanding Crypto series by Thomas Plunkett. Uh, today we're going to do a book review of Bitcoin and Cryptocurrency Technologies by Arvind and his co-authors. This is a great textbook, one of the first textbooks that covered uh, Bitcoin uh, in detail. Uh, it's a 2016 textbook. Uh, my slides are on Creative Commons. So as I said, this is a great academic textbook. Um, and the authors ha uh, have used this textbook to teach courses on Bitcoin for Princeton and Coursera. So if you took the uh, Coursera cryptocurrency class, they actually use this textbook in it. Um, some of the topics they go into in this textbook include an introduction to cryptography, how Bitcoin achieves decentralization, the mechanics of Bitcoin, how to store and use Bitcoin in a wallet, Bitcoin mining, uh, talking about the extent to which Bitcoin is actually anonymous or pseudonymous, talking about the, the Bitcoin community, community and its ecosystem, alternative approaches to mining, uh, Bitcoin as a platform, altcoins, and so on. Um, again, this is a great text, academic textbook. It is about five years old at this point. Um, it's out of date on some of the latest topics like the cryptocurrency ecosystem, altcoins, decentralization, and so on. But from a basic Bitcoin perspective, it's still pretty solid. Um, it's also goes into more academic depth than something like Mastering Bitcoin. So I would say, you know, look at the Mastering Bitcoin but, uh, textbook by Andreas for sort of your practical Bitcoin use. Look at Bitcoin and cryptocurrency technologies for your academic use. Um, another aspect of this uh, textbook is it goes into more detail uh, from a cryptographic perspective than uh, Mastering Bitcoin does. So, however, because it goes into more detail, it's more focused uh, and more appropriate for students who've already had some prior exposure to cryptography. So if you've already had some prior exposure to cryptography, then I think the Bitcoin and cryptocurrency technologies textbook is appropriate. Uh, if you haven't been exposed to cryptography before, um, you're probably going to want to review cryptography before you start diving deep into this particular textbook. Um, so again, thank you for watching this short little book review of Bitcoin and cryptocurrency technologies by Arvin and his co-authors. Uh, again, as I mentioned before, you, they use this textbook uh, extensively in several different academic courses, including the Bitcoin course taught at Princeton. So thanks for watching this video. Tune in next time when I'll dive deeper into understanding crypto.